I rise to put on the record my admiration and respect for two important groups in the Queensland community. And one of them is based on the Gold Coast these days. It's called the Stand By You Foundation. It's run by a fellow called um, Chris. Now, Chris Boyle is about as passionate as a person can possibly be about stopping domestic and family violence in our communities. And he's also observed that the traditional approach of just telephoning the police when things go wrong hasn't been very effective in reducing the incidence of uh, violence against women or, or indeed men who experience um, this kind of uh, violence. So he applied his deep understanding of, um, of social work and um, of his years in the field talking to women about what the barriers are to them, for instance, leaving situations that are dangerous. And he came to understand that domestic violence is really about disconnection. It's really about isolation. Because the first thing somebody who is perpetrating domestic violence does is isolate their victim from the connections they need to feel safe and to get help um, and to get the support and strength they need to be able to um, defend themselves in, in an effective way. He realised then that the antidote to isolation is connection. And so Stand By You Foundation's work is all about providing women who are at risk, who are in vulnerable situations, with the connections they need and easy ways to access those connections to get them out of dangerous situations fast and bring them to safety. With the Stand By You Safety Shield, which is a smart watch, which at the touch of a button can bring um, to your aid some of the people who you know, no matter what, would drop everything and come to help you if you're in danger. That invention has been so successful in a um, trial of the issue of 100 of those safety shields to women on the Gold Coast that despite them being highly at-risk women, despite the fact that the, um, the emergency button on the, the, the safety shield was pressed more than 3,000 times, only once did it escalate into the kind of actual violence that required um, emergency services to be called. And now, Stand By You are taking it a step further with the help of Westfield Helensvale. They've opened up Magnolia House. Now, Magnolia House is a shop front in the shopping centre and it provides an opportunity for people who are at risk of domestic and family violence to connect with all of the services that they need to be able to get themselves out of danger and into safety. One of the things Chris observed in um, his work was that even women in the most restrictive of situations were still allowed to go to the shops because every family needs food. And so it provided an easy way in an accessible place for vulnerable people to get the help that they need. I want to commend Chris and the team at Stand By You, and I also want to do a shout out to Westfield Helensvale for their generous support for a peppercorn um, lease of this important project. It is very literally um, creating opportunities to break a cycle for another generation of young people, and it is providing real ways out of dangerous situations for women in need.